What's up? What's up, everybody? It's Elmo172331. How you doing? I hope you're doing great. <laughs> I know y'all didn't see me last night because, man, this week has been a hustle for real. But as promised, we are going to do a review and reaction video to the Fast and the Furious 9. That's right, Fast and the Furious 9 <laughs> for you guys. Um, shout out specifically to RL, man, because he's been like ride or die with us and we want to do some, you know, special things that our selectors request. So this one goes out to the real OG RL. <laughs> um, so as usual, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, and visit our latest YouTube video down below. There it is right there. And also our link tree, L A N K T R dot E forward slash select screen. All right. Woohoo. So let's get into it, shall we? All right. <laughs> Okay, folks, so uh, as usual, we have to preface it by saying that there will be no footage shown, no footage shown, and, and I can know some people get a little like, well, why? Um, because we want to actually keep our channel, so like screen and eyes, so no footage, but I will give you um, my reaction to it, and of course, you could see the trailer pasted all over um, <laughs> on your TV screens, on your internet screen, so it's no biggie, but um, anyways, uh, Fast and the Furious 9. Um, just watched the trailer and, um, my, my initial reaction for this trailer is to give it like, to give it an A plus, um, pros and cons to this whole thing. Okay. Um, let's start with the cons. I normally start with the bad and then like elevate to the good. So cons of this are that it is Fast and the Furious 9. And so when you have nine things in one series, you have to constantly create new and um, like effective ideas. Otherwise, your uh, whole entire movie, your whole entire budget is going to fall by the wayside. So um, they're even saying in the trailer, like, man, we've got we've bought cars, we've got trains, we've bought planes and all this kind of stuff. <laughs> and so they're kind of, you know, making a joke about it. But there are nine of these movies in the series y'all so um the cons of this are that they're going to have to keep reinventing themselves in order for this movie to be successful for people to enjoy it and so that they don't feel like they're seeing the same movie over and over again and just like <laughs> at a different period in the year right okay so like there are nine of these okay so there's only so much that you can do with cars nine times, okay? So that's the biggest con in my opinion. Now, as far as the pros go, okay, this movie has the same feel that all of the rest of the Fast and the Furious movies have. It they like it has the same cast, um, plus a few extras in there that I'm sure you guys will be excited to see. Um, it's got action, 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 <laughs> um, and all kinds of different elements um, that it goes back to the original Fast and the Furious and yet it kind of pulls it into um, like a new generation of Fast and the Furious. Um, it throws it back a little bit to Paul Walker. You see a brief flicker of him on the screen and so it kind of tugs with your heartstrings a little bit. Um, I like that they focus on Dom and um, you know they try and give him a, even a little bit more backstory. They have Han in here and all of um, uh, like the original characters like I said and so uh, I think it's gonna shape up to be a pretty good movie like um, the Fast and the Furious isn't really about you know deep thought like you know different outlooks or whatever but it's just a bunch of cool dudes and cool ladies driving around in some like bomb looking cars um like beating up bad guys and doing it all before bedtime and so you really can't go wrong with that you know 
It's for fun, it's for style, it's for swag, and that's what Fast and the Furious has always done, and I think it will continue to do. Um, I feel like this movie has a segue into a Fast 10, and I hope at that point that's when they cut it, <laughs> you know, they cut the rope. But for having nine of these movies, it has the same feel, um, it has, you know, the great actors that we all like have come to know and love and um has cool cars and all that great stuff so overall for this trailer plain and simple i'm just gonna give it an a plus it does the job that it needs to do like um it has uh the hype that people want to see it throws out little tidbits of action people want to see um and um, it adds to the storyline a little bit, so you can't really ask for more for this. So, um, congratulations, Fast Nine. <laughs> um, so, I would recommend go going to see it just from this trailer, but we'll wait and see, all right? So, let me know what you guys think about the trailer. Is it a is it a yay? Is it a nay? Is it somewhere in between? So, like a yay nay, or <laughs> what do you think? Let me know. I want to hear from you. And again, a shout out to RL specifically for requesting cool stuff like this. Um, and if you, uh, you know, like I said, if you haven't already, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. Donate via the Cash App. Y'all know the drill. So um, I will check in with you guys um, a little later, later on in the week. Um, and so until then, take care of each other. Be kind to one another. Don't forget to choose your destiny. Um, look out for select screens, um, reviews of Falcon and the Winter Soldier, uh, playthrough of WWE. And we're going to have our Mortal Kombat weekend coming up here shortly. So uh, stay tuned for that. All right. All right, guys. Um, be cool. Take care. Choose your destiny. I'm out. <laughs>